100,000 Robux? Just let that process into your head. Yes, there is a way you can get 100,000 Robux for free. This is not a drill, this is not a joke, this is not a lie, and here's how. Back by popular demand! Rare High Wings Costos for Halloween starts now! The St. Patrick's Wings were just too good to not step up our prize game! The prize is now 5,000 Robux per winner! The deadline is September the 25th. More info at Submit Your Designs here. So yes, I know that says 5,000 Robux, not 100,000, so you're probably thinking, um, where is this number coming from? I am going to explain that now. So if you go and click on that form that was shown, you'll be linked onto this, and it says Rare High Halloween Wings Contest. Showcase your artistic talent by entering a set of wings for Halloween in Rare High. There will be 15 to 25 winners which will be selected to win 5,000 Robux and their wings featured in Rare High. So yeah, there's between 15 and 25 wings that are going to be on made by you guys. <laughs> And so that means if you were to be 20 of the winners, I was going to say 25, but like, let's just take it down to 20 because it's an even number. <laughs> so if you just happen to be 20 of those maybe 25 winners, that would mean winning 5,000 Robux 20 times. So that means you would get 100,000 diamonds, which means that the highest you could get was 125,000, but I'm just gonna say 100,000. <laughs> But okay, the contest rules. The wings must be submitted before September 25th. The wings must be a digital file in PNG format only with the left and white wings in separate files. The wings must be your own unique Halloween themed creation, not the work of someone else. And you have to be in Call Me Bob's group below to receive Robux since that's how you will receive it. So yeah, first of all, I just want to show you all the submissions for the St. Patrick's Day one, just to show you all just how many submissions that were because there were a lot so yeah as you can see there is the original tweet 2.6 thousand comments that is a lot and so yeah with this the prize was 10,000 diamonds so it was like you couldn't convert the diamonds into your other account since trading's well it's still not out <laughs> So yeah, like if you won it on two diff if you won ten thousand two times on two different accounts, you wouldn't be able to get it all in one account, it'd be on the two different accounts. But okay, yeah, so as you can see below, there's the contest details things, basically the same as what you saw in the Halloween one, and there is another 800 comments. So let's say there's about 3,000 submissions, and only 20 of them are going to be chosen. <laughs> Um, what are the chances of you getting through then? Okay, let's go and see now. Okay, I have my calculator out, and so you want 3,000 divided by 20. You have a 1 in 150 chance. I kind of thought it'd be higher. <laughs> like, as in the chances would be lower, so it'd be 1 in more than 150, you know? <laughs> But okay, it's 1 in 150, although if you're going to win 20 times, I mean, that makes it a lot harder. So, when you're going and you're filling in the form, Roblox username, you know, you put in your username, um, we're going to say the, and then your Twitter or Instagram username, um, hi. <laughs> this is so not real. Okay, the left wing submission, you just press add file, you know, and then you press select files from your device, and then you add it, yeah, the cancel. <laughs> And then you do the same for the right wing and it has to be a PNG which means it's a transparent photo that way if you have like effects and stuff it works and also because PNG and takes time trust me <laughs> and then this name selection for your wings hmm which name would I like to see on wings um what about crystal candy i'd like to see a wing called crystal candy <laughs> so we're just gonna write in crystal candy as if we're submitting some wings that we actually wanted to be called crystal candy but yeah then you press submit it shouldn't work right yeah because 
it seems this is a required question. <laughs> a bit, a bit weird if I submitted it and this is like Roblox username, the. It's a bit weird. <laughs> okay, so now we've went and submitted it, let's say, and you submitted 20. Obviously, it's going to be a very low chance of winning 20 times. But I did think of some things that would kind of increase your chances of winning more than once. And I will go through them now. So first of all, well, your wings need to be good, obviously. <laughs> I mean, that's a bit obvious, isn't it? You know, you may want to spend a few hours on each pair of wings. I don't know how long it takes to draw wings, but it definitely takes a while. So yeah, definitely take your time with all of the wings, make them unique, make them look amazing. Just, you know, overall, make sure they're fabulous. Also, when you're making the wings, make them in different styles and sizes because if you have a ton of large wings, then that means what about like the cheaper wings because that's to be cheap ones and the middle price ones and the expensive ones. So you may want to draw some small wings, some like medium sized wings, some large wings, you know. That way you'll, more, you'll be more likely to get in since there'll be a bigger sort of price range thing. <laughs> Also, I recommend that you try switching up your styles between each wing because I feel like that would help because obviously why would you want loads of wings that kind of look the same? Like they're not the same but they kind of look the same because the style's the same. But if you were to change up your style with each one, I feel like that would increase your chances because the wings, you know, would be more unique. They'd be more different and stuff. They wouldn't all look the same. And as you will know from the St. Patrick's Day wings, they all looked very, very unique. There were like small ones, there were big ones. They had different patterns on them. I think, did any of them have effects? I don't think so. But I mean, it'd probably be possible to recommend one, you know, just kind of shove it somewhere. <laughs> and the name suggestion for wings, put crystal candy and then brackets candy effects, please, you know, or something like that. And just hope they add candy effects. <laughs> I don't know if they would, but I mean, can still try. <laughs> Okay, so the last thing that I thought of was with the Roblox username, rather than using one account to submit all of them, as you all know with the St. Patrick's Day wings, there were some made by a ton of different creators, but there's no real way of knowing who it actually is. Oh wait. Okay, I just thought of something. I just realized because you have to enter in your Twitter name, you probably wouldn't be able to do what I thought you'd be able to do, which is basically to use different usernames with your submissions. So then Night Barbie will be like, oh, this is a different person. We'll um, select them and them because they're in different styles, even though it's made by the same person. <laughs> then you could get 5,000 Robux on both the accounts and you can sell clothes on your main account and then you can buy them on the other account and then that would transfer the Robux. I know you can do that even if you don't have Builders Club, so yeah, that would have been a good idea. But it asks for your Twitter slash Instagram, so they probably realise it's a new account and they probably would be less less likely to accept it. I think we got some pretty good tips. Switch up your style, switch up your sizes, make sure your wings are unique, and you know, just hope you win because there's a fair chance that you will win. Good luck to everyone that is having a go at this because I can't wait to see all of these wings. I know they're going to be so cool. But anyways, now let's go and look at some of the wings that have already been shown on in on Twitter. <laughs> Not Instagram. <laughs> so here we have a design by Ocean Orbs and it looks so cute. I love it. <laughs> And so yeah, it is a cat coming out of a cauldron and then there's also some candy effects. So you know, like I was saying, maybe you could just put the bottom, add candy effects please, Night Barbie. <laughs> oh, that looks so cute. The cat's just coming out of the cauldron. I feel like that would look really cool when it's done and stuff and there's all sorts of effects and things, some swirly stuff. Also, there is a pair of wings that Ocean Orb seems to have almost finished, so I will go and show them now. Okay, here it is. And so yeah, you can see this one is a cauldron and then you can see there's some effects and there's like the candy stuff and so I'm pretty sure this isn't quite done yet mainly because it's, it's not a PNG is it <laughs> no there's no transparent background I can definitely see the white background there but yeah I can't wait to see this when it's done I feel like it's gonna look so cool especially if there were some effects on this that would look so nice and I can't wait to see it when it's done so next up we have two pairs of wings by Annex RH and so these ones are like Dracula's cape Ooh, okay I mean are vampires associated with Halloween I guess yeah they are aren't they 
Oh, that's cool. Okay, I like that, you know, to become Dracula and Ra High. And then you also have these ones. Ooh, Blood Fairy. Okay, these ones are nice. And she's going for like bloody Dracula vampire sort of theme thing. <laughs> I like that. That looks cool. Next up, we have this wing by Crystal Pony1982. And I'm guessing it's going to be reflected since there's only one wing shown here. <laughs> but yeah, that looks so cute. You can see there's the witch. It's probably the bit that like attach is attached to your back. And then there's also a moon with some effects around it and some stars that would be perfect for the night time will there be night time in the halloween things coming up i will have to make a separate leaks video about the stuff that we kind of know about the halloween other stuff because yes there's other stuff and i will show that in a future video you just have to be patient so finally we have these ones by sugarstorm01 and it says how's my halloween wings should i submit them for the rare high halloween event and i think yes <laughs> I love them so much, they look like eyeballs and they have spiders on them, it's kind of creepy. Although I'm kind of realizing, is this like a proper wing thing or is it a model? Because I just realized it's like attached to a person and you're meant to just submit the wing, not a person with it. Or like a model is just meant to be the like picture of the wing. <gasps> Imagine if there were 3D wings in Rare High. That would be so cool. I feel like it wouldn't be possible because of like lag. But that would be so cool if you had 3D wings, you know, they had some depth on them and they moved around and stuff. That would be the best. <laughs> But anyways, that is the end of the video. Good luck to everyone competing in the design contest. Maybe you'll win 20 times. Probably not, but you know what? You could still win several times, win a fair amount of Robux, and every Robux counts. I can tell you that now because I am broke. I have exactly 140 Robux. <laughs> one like equals one Robux for me. But anyways, that is the end of the video. Make sure you ring the bell to be notified. You like and subscribe. And thanks for watching. And if you enjoyed. Yeah.